hello guys welcome back to another video so in this video i'm gonna be showing you guys how you guys can fix crashes and not launching issues in call of duty warzone 2 or modern warfare 4 so let's get started the video without wasting any time so i'm gonna be doing some possible fixes for this so first of all guys we're gonna have to clear all the clash memory from our computer system so in order to do that we have to press windows plus r button on your keyboard or right click on the start button and click on run and now type temp temp press ok and delete all the files in it skip the file that cannot be deleted again open run and type percentage sign before and after the temp like this and control plus a delete them all also and skip the file that cannot be deleted Again open run, now this time type prefetch p-r-e-f-e-t-c-h, delete all the files in it. At the end, make sure to empty your recycle bin to com delete completely. Now guys there is a link given in the description for this cod crashes fix raw file uh, make sure to download it after downloading it just simply right click on it and click on accept here open the file you will see three files in here first of all open this directx installer from microsoft it will update your directx version to the latest version if it's required a new update so run it uncheck this big bar and wait for it to install click on finish to go back go to directx properties by microsoft also open it click on this edit list and select your launcher uh, whether it is uh, battle.net or steam i play on steam so i have to select you guys have to select steam you guys have to select this steam.exe file application click open click add click ok now click on application controlled and you guys have to select these two boxes force warp and disable feature level upgrade click on apply click ok now go back open the cmd commands now go to search bar and type cmd and run as administrator now you guys have to copy the first command and paste it in cmd now you have to copy last three commands and press ok operation has successfully completed a reboot is required for the chain to take effect so type exit press enter now you guys have to restart your pc and run your game Hope this video helps you. Make sure to subscribe my channel and like the video. See you in the next video. Bye guys.